Hello, everybody. Good afternoon. Andrea Maestri here with Dental Oil Tutoring. Let me um, show you guys a couple things around the membership login area because some of you are having a similar type of question. So let me just kind of show you guys around a little bit here. So I have logged into the Dental Hygiene um, Board Exam Prep Academy. So if you're a dental hygiene student member or a dental assisting student, this may look a little bit different to you, but the same sort of, um, I guess, links apply. I mean, not links, but the same look kind of applies. So as a new um, member of Dental L, please make sure to watch the welcome video because a lot of you have the same questions that I do talk about in your welcome video at the top specific to what you signed up for. So if you're a dental assisting student or a dental assisting student taking the board exam, your welcome video will be different. So please take the time to watch it. Um, and that will just help you guys out so much. Now for the lecture video. So this is the first thing that all of you should be looking at. Because, I mean, we talk about questions, we talk about case studies, we, we um, talk about different topics, and you have all probably been reading a ton from your textbooks, from your notes, from all kinds of things. So sometimes it's nice to just sit back and listen, right? So make sure to watch those first. Now, I do suggest um, watching the more recent ones first, but this is different if you're a dental assisting student still in school or a dental hygiene student still in school. Because if you watch the more recent ones, they may not apply to you, and they may be over your head, and then you get overwhelmed. So I'll tell you, or I'll, um, I'll show you guys what I mean. So I'm going to click on um, over here. So recorded as sessions 2018, 2017. Click on that. And you will see um, a, a link here that says 2018 session recordings. Click on that for the most recent ones, okay? So let's say you're a dental hygiene student. So this endo um, case study session, we did that recently, but that may not apply to you. So you may not have to look at that. You can if you want. If you're studying for the board exam, you should, but if you're a student still in school, then this may not apply to you. But look at the different topics and then look at what applies to you. So does that make sense? So let's say you're a dental hygiene student and you have just learned um, pharmacology. I would watch the pharmacology case study session right here. So click on that and it's right there. So it's about an hour and 14 minutes where I go through case studies. And if you want to make it um, so that you are looking at it in YouTube, so the quality might be higher, click on the YouTube icon here, and then it takes you right to YouTube, right there. So it just kind of depends on what's easier for you. But um, so look at the lecture videos first, because those tend to be the, um, the most helpful. But So there's not too many yet for 2018. So move back to the other page, and these are all of them for 2017. So no matter if you're a dental hygiene student, a dental assisting student, if you're taking the board exam soon, you will find a topic in here that you want to look at. So let's say you want to go through um, ethics, okay? So um, again, depending on where you live, ethics might be a little bit different, but typically the same rules apply. So click on that, and to make it larger, you could even click on the full screen here, and look, there I am for about an hour talking about ethics. Now in this one, I'm more um, going through the PowerPoint, I believe, but still, you are always learning something new. So look at the lecture videos first. So does that make sense to everybody where all of the lecture videos are? So look at your main login area. Where's that? Sorry, I have a lot of things open right now. So look at your main login area. Make sure to watch the welcome video first. All of your um, lectures are here. Now, if you want to go first to the case studies and to the mock exams, then click case studies and mock exams, really easy. 
and all of the updated ones are here. And this will be updated um, every week usually, unless there's a holiday, because I did mention that we don't have tutoring sessions on holidays. But other than that, every single Sunday, there will be a new case study. So look at them all right here. Um, and if you guys want to look at the mock exams, there's a lot more in the private um, Facebook group that we have. You just have to do a search for mock exams. In fact, I can show you guys that if you like, just so you're fully aware. Um, sorry, guys, I'm just quickly logging into my Facebook here. There, I'll show you guys what that's about. So I'm going to share my screen again. So here's our private Facebook group here. So see the search. Now, I don't know if you can do a search from your cell phone or your iPad. Um, I'm usually on my computer, so I don't remember if the search function allows on a mobile or an iPad, but at least you know from your computer. You just have to search, just right here, you guys. Just type in mock exam, and they will come up. So see? Tons. So click on on where it says mock exams here. Click on that and click on under the comments. And I do explain everything here. So make sure to read the posts. That's why the posts are there. So um, there's a password for the mock exams. I believe it says right here um, dental L mocks and you just have to click on comment and look at all of the different ones. And then just make sure to click on um, view more. And there's tons over here too. So all you have to do, let's say you wanna look at the one for local anesthetic, just click, and then it will take you guys right there. And the nice thing is, if you want to learn by um, matching, click on matching. If you want to learn by test, click on test flashcards click on flashcards right here I'll just kind of show you guys and look right there super easy so I try to make it a lot more exciting for everybody to study um, just again please make sure to watch your welcome video first um, and it does explain everything for you but if you're still not sure um, just post in the private um, Facebook group because I do try to check in there at least three times a day. Um, if you have a question for me though, make sure to tag me in the post because sometimes if other people post, then your posts could get pushed down and then I don't, I don't um, see it. So if that happens, I do apologize. Just make sure to tag me in it so that I can see it. Okay, so I hope this helps explain things a little bit easier. Have a good weekend, everybody. And um, just on a side note, um, also to remember, don't study more than six hours a day, two hours to six hours a day max. And it's the weekend, okay? There is no harm in taking some time off either. Honestly, I am a, a full ad, um, advocate for taking time off to you guys because you need it. So thank you guys for watching and I'll see you guys next Sunday for our next session.